Hey, are you a creative person and you're planning to create a course, but you want something that you can customize, add your own colors, add your own brand? Well, Tea Tree is the most perfect uh, course platform that I found that it fits my creative brain because I can customize my courses. I can add a like own branding to each course. And I have so much fun creating and decorating and creating my course in Tea Tree. So today I'm going to show you how I create my courses in Tea Tree. So here you can see my first one course that I created in Tea Tree. Uh, it's called Simplify Notion. As you can see in Tea Tree, you can add images. So all this is image, uh, the banner, and all this. This is uh, all images that I've created them in Canva. And I customize with all my brand colors. And I this is like completely customized. So this is my other course that I have where I show my students basically how to sell Notion templates online. And as you can see, I use the same brand colors, mostly the same colors, but they have a different vibe to fit my target customer and my students. And I have so much fun creating this. And it's all images that you can create them in Canva. I have the templates for it. Something else I've created in, in Tea Tree is a customer hub. This uh, is what I give to all my paying customers. If they buy any templates from me, anything on my shop, they get access to this link and they get access to a CEO planner and favorite tools and they get um all the bonuses so i can get give them all the bonuses all in one place and i find this very useful and i give to my customers and i also have this 12 week year hub because i love this method to set my goals and i've created like more than three templates for it so what i do now um customers that get the new 12 week year, they get access to all the other versions and future versions. So they don't have to keep buying the same template, uh, just because I did any update or something, there's instructions for all the templates and you also get, you can get into my simplified option course and there's always free goodies like freebie. I don't know if you've seen my other video that I made about tea tree and the coaching program that I joined so I get access to teach Tree lifetime without having to pay a monthly fee and basically with my first course launch I nearly covered the price that I paid and now I'm keep launching my courses and keep selling my courses and I don't have to pay any anymore for the platform which is amazing um, so here I'm going to show you what it's possible to create in Tea Tree. Uh, one of the things that I love is they, that they give us um, these themes that you can basically just um, start with the, with the theme and you can just customize your own branding. So as you can see here, there are templates for designers, artists, intro instructors, uh, influencers and content creators. And I loved that they created a theme just for Notion templates because I, I have a lot of students that sell Notion templates. They are open their shops and uh, selling Tea Tree is a really good way because you have everything already integrated and you can sell, you can give not only your template, but you can give them tutorials and basically like a mini course, uh, which is really fun. So Tea Tree is the most customizable online course platform that I found. And yeah, you can start with um, the themes. And I am affiliate for this program because I love this program so much and I use it for myself. If you plan on launching a course and you want to join Wayne Unlimited, you get lifetime access to Tea Tree, which is the same program that I joined. And you get lifetime access to monthly business coaching as well, which is super fun. And I have an affiliate link because I absolutely love this program where it's where I host my courses, where I host my customer hubs and where I basically host pretty much a lot of things. And if you want to join using my link, 
I'm giving away my Notion course kit, which is a Notion template that I've created to plan all the content, the sales page, all the things that I need to, in order to launch and manage the course. And for everyone that is joining in this round of by the seven, by the 17th of October of 2023, I am uh, offering a one-to-one -one call for everyone that joins using my link uh, because this is something that can really help you if you're launching a course, you can feel very overwhelmed. I'll leave all the links below. We are going to go to the planning phase of creating the branding of your course. So I have a Notion template called Notion Template Course Kit, which uh, basically I created for myself to organize my course planning, course content, and I created a page only for branding. So I can have an idea of the vibe that I want to create the experience and main things about branding, like font colors, color codes, and all these things. And so I keep them all in one place. So I'm going to show you how I do that. Right. So that's the template that I use to organize my online courses. And basically I like to leave the main links at the top. It, as you can see here, that's the quick links where I go to Tea Tree, uh, where I go to my email provider and use Flowdesk, my sales page, my payment page, waitlist. They are basically like quick links that I can access them very quickly. And I also have all the links here. My goals, I like to set these widgets whenever I'm launching my course so I can um, know how many days I have uh, to work on it. So, and I also have a, um, weekly view that it's integrated with my main agenda. So I don't have to keep switching between, um, my main agenda in a database only for the course. So whenever I have something to do, let's say, let's say recording, I need to add this to my main agenda. So that's, um, links to view of my main agenda, basically. Uh, that's the task manager. So basically when I set a date for it, it shows up in the calendar. And I, something also that I like to use is task per priority. So I can see which tasks that I need to get done first. So that's it for the task manager. Um, I also have a course content overview, which is basically like the modules, um, each each book, each um, column is a module of the course and these are the sub lessons of each um, module. And here I have all the links, but I'm not going to show everything in detail about this template. I'm going to show you about the branding because uh, that's the main point of this video. Be, I want to show you how I create my uh, designs and everything. So here is are uh, the main colors that I use. I like to um, make sure I have everything in one place because that helps me if I need the, the color code and everything. And I also decide like what type of um, fonts that I want to use, the imagery, the elements, all these things I decide before even creating the course and before creating the assets in Canva. And that's um, how I plan the branding. But the next thing that we're going to do is to start creating our assets in Canva. Right, so the next thing that we need to do uh, when we are creating our course in T-Tree, we need to create this Canva um, asset. Uh, you can create them anywhere basically, but I create them in Canva because I find it so much easier. Um, so I have to create all these images that are going to add this personal touch to my course. And what I have here, I have different sizes and I created a folder in Canva. This is actually a quick tip for you because if you are a content creator, you know that you are going to have loads, loads of files in Canva. So I created a uh, folder. And here I have all the assets that I need in order to create my course. And this is a module cover is basically like the title of the each lesson. And this is a button. So you can tweak your own button to your, uh, to your branding and everything. 
page author, this is something that you're going to need to add in your sales page. Uh, T3 offers like a very basic sales page is the same one that I use to sell my, my online courses, but they are not super fancy. I'm going to be honest with you. They are not like the best sales page you're going to find, but I use them because it's easier and I don't want to pay another software just to host a sales page. And I have, this is assets for the sales page. This is the course overview so it's basically that banner that it's the first thing that you see when you when you enter the course uh this is for the payment page this is for upsell if you want to add upsells to your course uh this is the background and all the assets for sales page and for the payment page this is the course overview uh image that you are going to add in your course and basically I just add elements that are, that make sense to my course. Um, so basically there's a compass, there's like money plans, and there's a notion template here because this course is all about how to become a lotion seller. And I add all these elements and colors to my branding. So I customize all the elements with my colors. And here is the same thing I created, but is, that was not for a course, that was for my customer hub. And I basically keep tweaking them. Um, and I create this for all my eyes. So now I'm in the back end of Tintree. This is uh, what you get access to when you are creating your course in the back end. And these are uh, all images, as you can see. So basically, if you created your own, um, course cover course banner you are just going to come here and click here and upload your file and it's going to show up and it's super simple um so you have to tweak the other things as well this is our all images but that you cannot change them through here you have to go through all the course pages so when you start a new course you're going to divide it in modules so I have Notion Basics, start here, Notion Basics, Notion a little advanced. These are modules and inside this module, each module, I can add sub lessons. And that's what I did here. So for example, let's go to the Notion Basics page. Um, here I have the main, uh, the videos and how I host these videos is I use Vimeo. So I create uh, the slides for each lesson. And of course I take a, like a, just save the image. For example, for this lesson, I save the image and I go to Vimeo. So Vimeo is a paid uh, software that I pay, I think $10, $10 a month, something like that. So I can host all my videos that I don't want to delete in Vimeo. So I don't have to keep all these videos on my phone or on my computer. I add them all to Vimeo. And for example, here I have all my lessons and to make, make sure they look pretty like that, I just have to uh, add a thumbnail to each video. And how I do that, I just click on here and I upload. The thumbnails are basically the slides that I've used uh, for the tutorial, so I don't have to create a new one. And that's basically how I do it. So after I upload, record my lessons, created the, um, all the assets and everything, I copy this embed link that Vimeo gives me and I can add to Tea Tree. So in Tea Tree, you can add blocks. Uh, for add texts like this, just normal text or image or anything that you want to add. So here you can customize the text. Here you can add vi um, video, image, a link, an emoji, a file, anything. And if you want to add a new video, all you have to do is just create a new content block, embed code, you paste this embed code in here and that's it 
and then the person your students is going to have access to this so i'm just going to delete it because we don't need this here we already have it and that's how it, that's how it works it's very simple and when you are creating your course you have to go through all the pa all the pages you have course emails teacher is sent the emails for um your students uh how you can style your course so you can add um so you can customize like these buttons to make sure they are all on brand and it's nothing like too complicated it takes a while until you get familiar with the platform but once you do it's so much fun now that tea tree has all these new themes i'm so excited to create more courses but i don't want to create new courses and just keep piling up courses because i have so many things i want to do on my other courses yet but i want to improve that but if you want to join wayne using my affiliate link i created all these canva templates for you that the same canva templates that i've used it to create my online course I'm going to be sharing with all the people that join using my affiliate link. And I'm also offering a one-to-one -one call just for the, uh, just for the people that join by the 17th of October, because they are increasing their prices for the first time in five years. And that was one of the reasons that I've joined, uh, in 2023 as well, because I didn't want to get the price, the increased price basically. Um, and yeah, you get my cover template, you get my notion template for planning your course, you get the cover templates to, to create your assets and you also get lifetime access to tea tree. So you can basically host your courses forever, work with your creativity, sell your digital products. You don't even need to create a course. You can create hubs for your customers. You can create, um, sell your notion templates or sell digital products. And it's super fun. It's, it's a big investment. Take your time. If you have any questions, you can send me a DM on my Instagram. And I'm happy to. If you enjoyed this video, if you took anything from this video, please leave a like below because that really helps me grow my channel. I'm putting a lot of energy on this channel this year. And yeah, so share with someone that you know is planning to create a course. Or if you have any questions, just send me on my DM and I'll love to talk to you. Bye.